Hey everybody, it's Jerry. Y'all, I'm gonna show you how to make a butcher knife. Uh, this is the one I just made. Out of just a piece of a saw blade. Using only, using only an angle grinder and a belt sander. Oh yeah. All right, I've got the basic shape cut out. I was gonna round off the handle, but I think I'm gonna just square it off like a sort of traditional style butcher knife. Oh yeah. She's almost ready to do a little shaping and uh, or a little detailing, I mean, and then, and then the heat treatment. After I do the heat treatment, I'll start on the belt grinder. It's going to look good, y'all. going to look good. y'all this is just as done as I'm going to get it I would polish on it some more but my abrasives are kind of screwed up and I done cut the shit out myself again y'all this knife is for it's going to be for for Papa Texas for Papa's kitchen <laughs> <laughs> Papa's kitchen. Papa or not let me play with sharp stuff. God almighty. I have to find me some tape and bandage myself up. Then I'll get started back on this handle and I'll come back and uh <laughs> and shut and she's got on. I got blood everywhere. Alright, I'll be back, y'all. Yep, y'all. This is pretty much it right there. Oh yeah, you wipe the blade off just a little bit. I found my fingerprints off of there. Sand off these rough edges, which I think that's about good enough. And for my favorite part, oil that oil just brings everything out all that pretty grain look at there papa's knife for papa's kitchen <laughs> Yeah, Lord. And that's it. I oil this up one more time. Put that oil soak in there, oil it up one more time. And ship it out. Papa, Papa, Texas. <laughs> that big smudge right there. That's not a fingerprint. That's where I didn't get it all good and shiny. My abrasive, my uh, my belt. I cut myself, y'all. The knife had caught into the belt. 
where it was wore out and it's just I can't do any more with it but it's okay it's okay that's a good carbon steel it will be uh, unless Papa takes real good care of it it will be tarnished again and you'll never be able to tell it I'm gonna wipe my fingerprints and all off of this in case Papa decides to get into some kind of weird activities with it anyway that's it Papa Texas butcher knife All right, y'all, I'll see you later. I'm out of here. Take it easy.